Well, I would say in one word, it is um, an achievement. It's an achievement because uh, when we started back in 2007, uh, you could barely find uh, many classrooms as we have today. There was only this one building with a big hall in one classroom. Yet the consultation to start the university took place and everything was launched. And since then, we have seen the number of students growing. And uh, when we reached 2010, 2011, we started releasing students in the community to go and be the change in the community. And from that time up to today, I think we have 433 students. You know, the vision of the institutions is being transformed to transform. And those students are in the community and they are already having an impact in the different communities. And that's the celebration that we want to do to see what God has done in the last 10 years for us to be able to have 433 students in the community working with the perspective of life that they uh, acquired from UCBC. That's already huge. And their impact in the community is felt as we get feedback from different members of the community. And so there is hope for Congo to be changed and to be transformed through these agents of transformation who have been transformed and released in the community. That's why we are celebrating 10 years of hope and transformation. It is 10 years for the accomplishments or achievements, but also 10 years to say, he who has brought us thus far is able to bring us for 10 more years and to be the best we can. Second afternoon, as the rector always says, that is our target. And so we are moving towards excellence. Excellence from all perspectives, academically, spiritually, in terms of service, in terms of growth, in terms of partnership, in terms of research, globally. Excellence, that is our purpose. That is the vision. It's a vast and encompassing vision, but a vision that is for a time such as this in DRC, in Africa and even for the world. And so we thank God for that.